Welcome to PGA Championship Golf from Sierra Sports. It's a calm day here. Going straight at the flags will be the winning strategy with these soft greens. Anyone driving it into this rough is going to pay a fair price to get out. This one is long and right. Apparently going with an 8 iron for this shot. This might just make it. That one's aboard. This putt for a birdie three. This one could get away from him if he's not careful. Really slick. Birdie putt, nothing but hole. And we're off to number two. This par five rises dramatically. It'll really penalize the low tee shot. Players probably won't be too disappointed with pars here. This hole is straight uphill. Boy, this is a big hit. Apparently going to go with the three wood here. This ball has come out to the left. There's deep rough over there. What can you tell us? A nice breeze blowing toward the pin should give this ball a little bit more carry. Gonna go with the sand wedge. A tap in birdie. A two footer. Yes, it's a birdie. We're off to number three. This is one par three where players are just trying to put it aboard. Going with the seven. From the tee, this ball is well struck, very well struck. It's on there. This to pick up a stroke. This putts just outside of 20 feet.
This one's right on target. Just a touch left. Nice par. And we head to the fourth hole. This hole really goes downhill. It's tempting to these golfers to overswing off the tee. Staying to the right side is the key here off the tee. Nice ball going down the left side of the fairway. The five wood is going to go with the five wood. Headed toward the green. Is it going to stay on the dance floor? Safely on the putting green. What are we looking at here? From way downtown. This one has the line. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that one missed. Nice birdie. Let's go to number five. This one's leaking a little bit to the right. Is he going to find the rough? Going to go with the pitching wedge. Nice shot. Right on the pad. To pick up a stroke, this for a birdie. This putt should move right to left. Nope, never even hit it. Poorly hit. Weak right. This for a par four. They've missed this putt to the right all day. This one's right on target. To six. These players need a solid tee shot to get things off on the right foot on this straightaway par four. They can get some extra distance off the tee here. A well-hit ball can make getting on and two much easier. Absolutely perfect, exactly where you want to put it off the tee. Looks like a nine.
Headed toward the green. This putt for a birdie three. Not much to this one. This one's got to go. Oh man, just outside the hole on the left. This has been an easy hole. A par here is like giving a stroke back to the field. This is a short putt, but he's got to be careful. The par putt goes down. And we head to number seven. Going with a three iron. Oops, this one looks bunker bound. Uh oh, that one caught the bunker. This chip from just off the green, a makeable birdie. Tough break, it's in the bunker, but playable. To drop a stroke for bogey should be an outside right putt. He overhit that one just a little long and right. He needs this for a double. A long three feet to the hole. That was a double bogey. We move to number eight. Low tee shots on this par four won't get much roll as they move up this severe slope. Now this one's long, but there's deep grass out there on the left side. The rough could come into play. Ball sitting up. That's a lucky break. Looks like an eight iron. Well struck. Looks like he's out nicely. This for a par four. Right to left break here. This one has the line. Let's go to the final hole of the outward side, number nine. A nice straight par four here to give these players a chance to pick up a stroke. Well, he caught that one flush. That's right down the left-hand side of the fairway. Should be fine. Oh. 
Looks like a sand wedge. It's on the green. The shot for a little breathing room. About a half foot. Just a little too much speed on that one. This a hole to take your par and move on. Two feet away. Nice par. We're off to the tenth tee. Well, he caught this one, but I think it's drifting. This may not stay in the fairway. What's he got here? It's in the thick stuff. Got a long iron, looks like a three. Out of the deep stuff, headed toward the green a little left. He'll be putting from there. This putt should be interesting. This one goes right. How much depends on the speed. Didn't hit it. Lost it right. This putt for a little elbow room. Everyone's been misreading this putt today. Good birdie. We're off to number 11. This is one par three where players are just trying to put it aboard. Pulled out the seven iron. Wow, this is a big hit. It's headed toward the green. That one's on the dance floor. Looking good. Birdie putt, nothing but hole. To 12. From the tee box, this par four drops down onto the fairway, offering golfers a great opportunity to go long. This is long and way out there down the left-hand side of the fairway. Looks like a lob wedge from here. He needs this for Berta. This one's moving right all the way. That one's out to the warning track in right field. To get in with a par, this putt should break to the left.
and it goes in for a par. Next up, number 13. This par four, a big dog leg to the right. That one's going to carry. This is perfect. There's a breeze coming from left to right. Nothing really to worry about, though. Looks like a sand wedge. It found the rough. Tough break. This chip from just off the green for a birdie three. It's in the rough. Not much of a chance to put spin on this one. He needs this for par. Breaking to the left. Oh man, just outside the hole on the left. It drops for a bogey. To the 14th tee. As par threes go, this one's a doozy. It's going to be pretty tough to put it on this green. Apparently switching to a four iron for this shot. This ball was going long and left, but it looks like it's headed toward the green. It's on the green. This putt for birdie. This one's a simple left to rider. Not much break to this. Just a touch left. Nice par. Just four holes to play. We move to number 15. Well, he caught that one flush. That's right down the left-hand side of the fairway. Should be fine. How's it look? The wind is at his back and should help add some distance to this shot. Apparently going to go with the three wood here. Little left to center, but should be okay. Kind of an in-between shot. Going to go with the lob wedge.
Nicely played. That one's aboard. This for a birdie. This one looks like it'll roll off the table if he's not careful. Just a bit to the right. Oh, missed it just right of the hole. This for a par five. Three feet out. Nice par. We move now to number 16. Nothing fancy here, just a tee box, a hole, and some yards in between. Accuracy on these straight holes is sometimes more important than distance. Well-struck ball, headed for the fairway. Going to go with the sand wedge. This one looks good. That one's on the dance floor. To make birdie. This one looks like it'll roll off the table if he's not careful. This one has the line. Drifted just right. has been an easy hole today. It's going to be like giving a stroke back. This for par. The par putt goes down. We head to the 17th hole. Big dog leg like this takes careful planning to get on in two for a chance at par. The key here is position off the tee on this dog leg right. No problem off the tee here. Going with the seven. From a perfect position in the fairway, it's leaking a little right, should catch the putting surface. This putt for Bertie. This putt's so quick that the course architect should be arrested. Just a touch to the left. Oh man, just outside the hole on the left. And it goes in for a par. To 18. No problem off the tee here. It looks like a five iron, and it is. This ball headed for the sand. That one caught the bunker. No chance out of this lie.
This for a par. This one's buried. No chance. This for a bogey. This one's from way downtown. Just a little long and left. This to drop two strokes. Maybe he'll play this one just right of center. A double bogey.